It was for me a wow moment, as the Vice Chancellor said at the graduation this morning, to be back uh, for an in person graduation, uh, hearing and seeing parents uh, ululate and uh, graduates uh, dancing on the stage. And uh, as we do that, it is my prayer that UWC will grow from strength to strength following this very morbid time uh, during COVID when a lot of people died in the country. And I pray that the students too will be uh, citizens that bring solutions uh, to the challenges of our time. Today felt great. It felt great, I don't wanna lie. Because it felt like a pat of the back because of all the rough times that we had the past two years, the losses. You know, it was kind of difficult to study, but to being here today reminded me that it was actually worth it. It is worth it and I wouldn't trade it for anything. This is my first year as Dean, so it's my first graduation ceremony. And it was a privilege to sit through an entire day, nearly, um, just in engaging with the loved ones and the students. So it was really exciting. The 1st of October, I'm starting a master's in Japan. Um, that's through the UN Japan PNST Fellowship. So what that means is I get to do a master's in nano satellite development. So I'm really looking forward to that. I just hope that we continue to have in-person graduations as we have had today. So congratulations once again. And if I was my predecessor, but one does one to two, I would have said yippee. <laughs> For my students, Kaylin Hurley, Kurt Engel, Mayor Plant, Catherine Poya, got the VN um, degree today, and they were all in my class, my maths class at the St. Louis High School, so it was quite a, a moment for me to see them on stage, you know, and uh, where they started and where they are now. We, at the moment, we are teaching, and then next year to teach again, and then also study further in the education faculty. I am also a UWC alumni and I graduated in the 80s. I am Kaylin Eddy. I am Kurt Engel. And we are UWCs.